is that colour? Oh, he's got eyelashes. I mean, she's got eyelashes. He said they had to be tasteful. Well, they aren't. They're rich girls' cars. Ah. Just before we start, we should make it clear that we are making fun of the stereotype. We are not enforcing it. Or reinforcing it, or whatever the term is. You know what I mean. Yes. And if you are offended by anything you hear today, leave us your number. I, I'm I'm overwhelmed at this point. What do we do? How does, well, how does this usually work? <laughs> we've essentially had the same thoughts as to choosing cars as well. Excellent. All oh, right. Okay. I've now rem I, re I've rem I remember how this works. I remember how we do a challenge. Um, let's start with a drag race. A drag race from one end of Mulere to the other end. So to see how fast you can get from one end of the shopping street to the other. To buy expensive handbags with money you didn't make yourself. Count him. Three, two, one, go. Okay, the finish line is uh, where the bridge intersects the... I think I'm all-wheel driving you on is what's happened here. Do the customers buying these cars know that sort of thing? Yes. Let's be honest, it's not the daughters themselves buying the cars. I think I've won that. I think you might have done. There's already 1-0 to the Audi TT. Rich girls like jewellery. So let's go to the Emerald Circuit for a race. As you can tell, we are not rich girls. We have no idea what rich girls' interests would be. So we're basically just structuring <laughs> like this like any other challenge ever. Goodbye, all-wheel drivers were best. What is a Crouton Baptist? What? What is a spruce bike? Oh, there's a person in front of me! What do I do? I don't know how to overtake! Ah. Ah. I just overtook a Ferrari! Ow! I just overtook another Ferrari! This is the fastest car in the world! So is this! Have you got the AI on easy? This car, I keep driving into walls. I don't know what to do about it. Oh no, I crashed my car again. Why did you crash into me? How would Audi crashed into me? You crashed into me! I will now never speak to you again for no obvious reason. What was that for? No way you're able to hold that drift. You're a rich girl. Don't send it like stroll. Outdated references by the time this video comes out, probably. Actually, it would probably be more accurate yeah. to say send it like Russell, because he probably would have dive bombed someone on T1 at some point. Get out of my way! You're in my way! Oh. We're halfway there! We're not. Maths is difficult. Yes. Which is why we've got minus £2,000 on our credit cards. Wait, credit cards are a limit? Apparently they do. I got in trouble the other day. Uh... <laughs> She's crashed! I just saw a oh, spinning no. thing behind me. It's very interesting. <laughs> you know what we should do? We should go to a music festival. We should go to like a festival and um, lose our wallets. And... No, wait, they don't have women. They don't have wallets. Like... It, what, what? Well, anyway, moving on. We should go to a music festival sort of thing and listen to Billy Eyelash. Or oh, whatever her name is. What? I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm not a rich girl, I don't know how life works. Speaking of going to a festival, let's do that. Uh, from here to the Horizon Apex. A race. I mean... Three, two, one, go. Petrolina. <laughs> Goodbye. Yes. Wait, what, what's the name of the thing on the side of your car? What, my Instagram handle? Yes. Lovely Abby. <laughs> Incredible. Hello! Oh, of course you've got the cat horn. 
I already had that. It doesn't make it better. Okay, I've got a duck. That makes it. I don't know what that. <laughs> I don't know what that implies. Probably that I'm pretending to be quirky when I'm not. Isn't that what these cars imply? Well, that you're quirky, but you're not. Probably. Yes. Why does it go red when you go into seven miles an hour? There's a red three and it's making a horrible noise and the little needles bouncing up and down. A red three? What the hell are you on about? I honestly have no clue what you're talking about. Oh! What does S5 stand for? Oh, I see what you mean now. <laughs> that took me a while. Imagine being a mechanic having to deal with phone calls like that, because I bet there are some that have had to do that have had to deal with silly rich girls explaining, oh there's a little thing that goes in I've got a needle and it's in red. Well, this is very practical. It's got a, it's it tells me my my heart rate. This is very good. It's like my Apple Watch. Apparently I've got a heart rate of 122, although it's gone down to 98. Oh, it's going to 100 120? Oh, my heart rate's going up. 140, 150. I don't think this is healthy. I need to go and go and post about this on Instagram and see if people will. I'm too, I've got 200 beats per minute. I need to go to the hospital immediately. Instagram will be so proud of me. This road is my not very well serviced. I must speak to the council. You're a rich girl. You don't know how to speak. The only form of contact you know is Instagram emojis. And s <laughs> I must shout about it on the internet. <laughs> If you are a rich girl and are offended by anything we're saying, again, don't feel free to contact us. We would like to talk to you. Well, you could always send us a super thanks to get rid of some of that spare money that's burning a hole in your pocket. Yeah, so we will definitely go to a charitable donation. It's a very charitable thing to do. It goes towards feeding our dogs and cats. In Petrol's case, that probably is true. <laughs> <laughs> Why? What? Have you... Oh no, there's a... Oh, that's you! I didn't oh, recognise you. What are those sunglasses? Are they... Uh... Oh, they're the same ones I've got. That's not good. We can never be friends again because you copied me, clearly. Anyway, we're at the festival! Time to listen to some bad music. Or we'll drive for the win! But why would it? I don't think a rich girl has ever shouted all wheel drive for the win. Um, I think it's two, two to one. Not that we know how to count, we're rich girls. Numbers are difficult. Yes, what does that mean? Is that a time? Is that a band? Oh look, there's tacos! But they're t they probably make us fat, we probably shouldn't have them, they've got too many calories. I'm too Mexican. What? They're rich girls Mexican. not like Mexicans. I don't know. <laughs> there's this horrible ringing noise in my car. Oh, I think there's a phone. Oh, hello. Hello. Hello, Abby. You and your friend Petrolina must now go to... I've got a face cam on. This doesn't work. <laughs> <laughs> must now... I think it's time for you to pursue higher education. Please meet Mr... Dumbledore. At the university. What? <laughs> I don't know! The first name that came to mind! <laughs> Get there as fast as possible. First person there gets a free bag. Count us in! Three, one, two, go! And we're on the way to go to meet Mr. Dumbledore! <laughs> All the offensive, of all the thing, offensive things we've said this evening, I think that's more that will get us in trouble. <laughs> anyway, what the? you just murdered a family in a BMW. Oh, that, that's fine. It means they're Germans. That was my alternate rich girl persona talking, not me. Just to be clear. The murder of Germans is only okay in, in this war video. films. Apart from the subscribe to fail and petrol. Although the rich girls agree. Oh no, I've, I've decided to not go in the corner. 
I'm, I'm going very far left. Like all rich girls. I've dismantled some signposts. Well, as long as you don't dismantle any trees, we're habitat for the koalas. Hey, there's a button here. Petrol, there's a button down here. I wonder what happens if I pull it. Holy moly! Help! Oh, this one. That's an amazing button! I like this button! It's like ballerinas! It's like figure skating! Because we're posh, we don't do ballet, we do figure skating. Oh no, I've just gone through a thing! I'm going... Oh, oh! Oh, this is a beautiful landscape here. Holy moly, I just jumped over a house! Did you do it as well? I only made it over one of them. <laughs> I've crashed. Oh no! There's... Oh, there's a BMW driver here. I must immediately go and talk to them. Because they must also be rich like me. I think I've won this challenge. I don't know if that's a good thing or if that's... that good? I don't know. Does that mean your car is better for the target audience? Or yes, it means that any rich you are girls... more in tune with the target audience. Any rich girls watching this video, um... Go buy an Audi TT. Actually, don't do that. They're horrible. Buy an MX-5 instead. Yes. Again, coming from me who doesn't like MX-5s, but just buy an MX-5 instead. This it's more interesting. This is better than any of these. And it's... The hatch, and it's got Z4? a convertible. Why would you buy a Z4? Oh yeah, because you're rich and want to prove it. And on that note, I do hope you enjoyed this rather peculiar challenge. If you did, do consider liking and or subscribing to both channels. Check out Purple Petrol's first point of view of this video and other great racing game content. Other than that, if you're feeling particularly generous, leave, leave a super thanks. Or subscribe. Goodbye. Have a nice day.